Welcome to iPacky. In this video we will demonstrate how to use picking lists and packing slips in iPacky. Select the menu. Select picking lists packing slips. This is the main screen for the picking lists and packing slips overview. What is shown in the list depends on the date range in the options and filters. The start date range. The default days back in time can be set in settings, defaults. The less than date range. Help about this screen. Setting defaults for this screen. Only available if you are logged in as a supervisor or hire through the iPacky dashboard. Otherwise this can be done in settings, defaults. Refresh the list using the date range. Picking list assignment. Only available if turned on and logged through the iPacky dashboard as operator or hire. Learn more about this in the help system or in a separate video when available. By moving the mouse over the order number or clicking on the order number, a preview of the first 15 order lines will be shown in a pop up. By moving the mouse over the name or clicking on the name, a pop-up will show the full shipping address. The country code of the recipient. Turn on in settings, view, show country code and lists. If there is a packer's note, move the mouse over or click on the icon to see the note. If there is a note from the customer, move the mouse over or click on the icon to see the note. Whether or not the order has been checked in iPacky. Whether or not the order has been picked. The shipping type selected at checkout. Enable in, settings, view, show shipping title in the picking list overview. Picking list assigned to. Only visible if picking list assignment is turned on. Shows the number of order lines, and the number of items on the order. Click to preview the order. Here you can see the preview of the order. You can even edit the packer's note and change the shipping address. Look up a specific order. Type in an order number and press enter. This will be looked up regardless of filters and date range. On screen batch picking. Learn more in the help system or in a separate video when available. In options you set the filters and options. The default values are set in, settings, defaults. Any changes you do here are saved during the session for this user. Maximum number of orders to show in the list. You can specify to only show orders with specific order tags, and to exclude orders with specific order tags. Only show orders with specified maximum order lines. Zero means ignore. Only show orders with specified maximum number of items. Zero means ignore. Select how to sort the list. Print selected orders with only order numbers and barcode on small address labels. Reset the status of selected orders to unpicked. This can be useful if by mistake you printed out picking lists, or something happened with the print. If off, recommended, it will not show orders that has already been picked. If off, recommended, it will not show orders that has been checked in iPacky. If on, recommended, it will show the member products of kits bundles only, and not the kits bundle itself in the picking list print will be ignored when doing batch picking since that will do this by default. Batch picking. Learn more about this in the help system, or in a separate video when available. Use fast mode to generate picking lists. This will speed up the generation of picking lists for print. It will ignore is selecting more than 100 orders for print. If you're experiencing issues, for example when orders are complex, turn it off. Specify whether or not to show the product photo in picking lists. Whether or not to only show paid orders in the list. 
Select Apply. The order list will be reloaded using the new settings. To select orders, you can select all by checking in the checkbox in the header. This shows the number of orders selected. This shows the total number of items in the selected orders. Uncheck to unselect all orders. A quick way to select the range of orders is to put a check on the first order in the range. Then hold down the shift key and check the last order in the range. Now that we have selected the orders, select the print button. The difference between picking lists and packing slips is that picking lists are used for picking, and packing slips are put in the shipment to the customer. The picking list can contain internal information such as timeline notes, product notes, bin location and more. This is not meant for the customer, and it's not recommended that you send this to the customer. The entries with print node will only be visible if print node is set up. Address labels are not shipping labels, but print of small address labels with only the shipping address. For example when putting on an address sticker on a stamped letter. Select picking lists. Please note that when doing this the order selected will be marked as picked, and will disappear from this list when refreshed. Click on the print button. This is an example of a printed picking list. The order number barcode. The customer's order note, if any. The timeline comments, if any. Enable in settings, view, show order timeline comments. The packer's note, if any. The product image. Enable in settings, layout, show product photo. Product note. Learn more in the help system, or the video about metafields. Bin location. Learn more in the help system, or the video about metafields. Order tags to be shown. Set in settings, view, list of order tags to show. The sorting of the order lines are set in settings, layout, sort order lines on. The orders being printed for packing list will be hidden with the status of pick when screen is refreshed. This can be visible again by selection show printed in the options dialog. Select print. Select packing slips. Select Print. Some layout settings, logo, and edit translation of the text can be set in, Settings, Packing Slip. You can learn more about Picking List Assignments, Batch Picking and On-Screen Batch Picking in the Help System or in Videos 1 available. Thank you for watching this iPacky video. For more details, read in the Help System or watch videos when they become available on epaki.com or on our YouTube channel. Follow us on Facebook. Start packing error-free today.